Maple Valley, Forza 4, ladies and gentlemen, let's get this going, man. Here we go. Everybody, it's your boy Slap Train. Welcome back, guys. Forza Motorsport 4 is back on the channel. Forza Week, ladies and gentlemen. I couldn't let you down. I had to pull this game out. Got the Xbox 360 set up, downloaded all the car packs that I have lost. Unfortunately, I guess I deleted my account when I moved over to Xbox One. So I'm back to level two. Thankfully, I got a buttload of money. We're going to be doing some builds today, just kind of exploring everything that we have been missing from Forza 4, man. It's a lot of stuff. Hopefully, you guys are ready, but I got to say, man, I have missed this game. Even this introduction gives me chills watching it, man. You got to understand, I spent probably three, four years on this game making friends, making the channel grow to what it is today, and I mean, this was the... You know, the start of the channel was Forza 4. And, you know, that's how we got our damn kind of niche market set was this game. So, I mean, this is a very sentimental game to me. Um, as, you know, everybody that does play this game or has played this game. One of the best Forzas to date. Hands down. Forza Motorsports 4. Welcome, guys. Back to the menus of Forza 4. It's been a long time since I've seen these, I gotta say. And first things first, I want to check out my club. Now, I, I don't know if I'm still even going to be in this club or not. Uh, but, oh, yes, we are. Look at these, man. Some OG tags here. Vossen, CVT, Wired Killer, Professor SP1, How Do I Drift, Shield HD, Mr. Taco. Oh, my God. Psych. I remember that, man. Oh, my goodness. It's been a while. We have Matt 11, Mr. Awesome 96, RNT Skywalker, Relentless. Uh, who else is on here from the OG pack, man? Eat Sleep JDM, Main Man Destroyers right there, Sill Lady Swag. Oh my god. You know it's OG when you see Sill Lady Swag on here. Only the longtime subscribers will remember that, man. Anti Cranium Boy, shout out to that, man. Hopefully you're doing well, pal. Uh, Akina's Ghost, yeah. Truly JDM EK9, good buddy of mine. Uh, who else we have here? I don't know how, you know, bumping the actual clans are on this game anymore, but maybe, maybe we'll get it going, man. Maybe we'll get the damn club hype going again. I don't know, maybe this will be a weekly series. If you guys do want to see more Forza 4 content go up, maybe some live comms, drifting with everybody online, I can set that up where you guys can hear them, hear me almost exactly like Forza 6 that we do. So I think it's going to be pretty damn crazy if you guys do want to keep seeing more of this. Personally, I think it'd be damn cool to do. Fun to play and overall just reliving some of these awesome tracks that we have not seen since Forza 4. And looks like we have no... Gr oh, whoa. We got a lot of cars in here. A lot of top secret. Oh, that's mine, man. Oh, God. Okay, appreciate it. Didn't even know that was mine. Psych, Mr. Awesome, he always had damn dope paint jobs, dope tunes. Look at all these destroyers. Vini with that beautiful modded 240. Supra, Mr. Awesome. Look at all these cars, man. I've missed these damn rides here. I just missed the simplicity of Forza 4, you know, the speed of this game. Everything about it, I have missed. And, you know, if we go to the menus here, you know, this game is very, very well done. Oh, Hold on here. We got to see where we're standing in the club rankings, though. That's got to happen. Uh, drift class. Let's see. Okay. 624. Not bad at all. Rear wheel drive. Oh, in the rear wheel drive portion, we are actually 176th in the world. Okay. Are sliding. I don't know if people are still sliding or not. I'm kind of curious right now to go find out. And, oh, yeah. We do that through community. So, race online. We're going to go to find race and then way at the bottom here. Look at this, man. This is what Forza 6 needs, man. I'm telling you right now, they need a user created races lobby. We go in here. We can then, you know, choose what we want to do. Point to point, drag, multi-class, soccer, whatever you want or elimination or just go straight up custom. And then that's where you're going to find pretty much everybody in here. So we actually have a couple lobbies going down here. Drag rolls, circuit race, cruise. 
Um, so, I mean, this was the thing that we all wanted to come back into the game because it just makes it so easy to find people that are trying to do similar things as you're doing, right? I mean, it just, it just makes sense, man. It, and it worked, which was awesome. So, wow, man, reliving that. We have the auction house as well, too. Uh, career though, we gotta see what is going down. Player Slayer 296, man. I'm busy right now about the slide. This 240, man. You know what we're gonna do? I have no idea what's on this thing. Let's have a quick check. Uh, just to see this, you know, the basics that we're gonna need. So, sport tires, that's good. Is our differential welded? That's true. Race diff, okay. Uh, appearance, we're not gonna touch any of those. Draw, oh, motor swaps. Okay, so, oh, drop a bomb right now, man. I totally forgot. That Forza 4 showed you which car your motor was coming from. That is huge right there, man. So as you can see, the S15 right here, we have the RB26 on that guy as well, too. So, I mean, this is, oh my goodness. Now, it does say 2.7. It threw me off for a second, but I believe this is upgraded, which increased the displacement of the car. So that's the RB26 in there, twin turbo. And that is just crazy that they do actually show you where these have come from, which I said was, you know, I feel a mandatory thing to be in the Forza Motorsport franchises moving forward. And we haven't seen that since Forza 4, ladies and gentlemen. I'm telling you, man, we need some of that good stuff coming back in. Uh, let's see what we got for some spoilers on here. Still pretty much the same, but I do like that damn active arrow though. It's nice. Horsepower, what are we running? 486. You know what? We're just going to run with what we got. We're going to go to the test drive and Fujimi Kaido. We're doing Fujimi Kaido before the end of this episode. Do not worry, but I'm feeling Iberian Mini or Maple Valley. You know what? Maple Valley, man. Let's get some high speed drifting going. Just a nice little cruise session reminiscing here on the days of Forza 4. Oh my god. Now the biggest thing for me though is that if this game comes to Xbox One, which it will, you know, in due time it will come. It needs to come with the playability of a wheel, guys. I'm telling you, if you can use your wheel on here with the Xbox One with the backwards compatibility, it's done. I will be on Forza 4 non-stop. And I'm telling you because this is... One of the best games that I have played, hands down, man. I'm telling you right now. Woo! Just a straight smoke show, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go, man. First attempt, Maple Valley, fours of four. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get this going, man. Here we go. Oh my God. This game, and I'm telling you, brings back some memories. We don't have as much power as I'd like to swing this full quarter, but we definitely have enough. And holy man, the physics on this game were perfect. And you know, I wish that every Forza moving forward had the same physics as Forza 4, but unfortunately, that's not the case. But it would have been pretty damn fun. Four, fours of five and six to kind of incorporate some of fours of fours physics there's no doubt oh geez. just tap that bumper just a little bit and you know what we should do man you know what we're gonna run a quick high speed and then back out and make a quick car here because that is what we need to do man we gotta have a look at the car list upgrades and see how fast this game runs compared to fours of six man i'm telling you it is light speed here we go here we go high speed man i haven't done this in a little bit Oh, not that much. And that was a fail. We need to get that one more time. Let's drop the hammer, man. It's very tough using this controller that I have. I have like an Xbox aftermarket, afterglow it's called or something like that. But the throttles though, man, they're so tough to really like fine press, you know, not fully press them down. Here we go. Oh yeah. Oh, we stole her. Oh my shit. We didn't get a lot of air anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But overall, though, I miss this game, man. I don't know how many times I'm going to say this to you guys, but I definitely do. One more rip on this high speed right here, man. We got to do it. Look at this thing just banging that third gear. How close can we run it? Oh, man, we pitched out. Oh, my chance. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I wanted to run it closer. Just didn't end up happening. I thought I was going to. I let off for that quick second, man. You don't lift. 
You don't lift on that shit. But, like I'm saying though, I, I honestly cannot wait to get into some online lobbies. We're going to do one build for today and, uh, wow. I'm pretty happy I actually took the time to download everything because, I mean, the tracks that we have on this game is just, it's huge, man. Let's have a quick look at the full list. So, we do not have Camino. This is first track right away. Don't have it. For Jimmy Kaido, unfortunately, do not have it. Iberian Mini. Oh, man, you know how many times I went around this thing? It's ridiculous. Uh, we just got a Finney on Raceway, which is nice. The Landra Test Track. Beautiful track. Love it. Would love to see it come back. Maple Valley, Laguna Seca, we've always had. Magello, I don't think we have anymore. Uh, or we do. I don't know. I'm pretty sure we don't. Maybe we do. Rally de Pastiano. Whatever, man. We don't have that, though. That's in Italy. Um, what else do we not have? Sedona. Oh, man. Sedona, we don't have. Uh, I don't think we have Sedona. Maybe we do. I'm tripping right now. We do have Sedona. What the hell am I talking about? Maybe we don't. Why am I thinking that we have it? Oh, we definitely don't have Sedona. Okay. Uh, Sunset Peninsula. Oh, my God. That's a beautiful track. Suzuka, we do not have, unfortunately. All right, so Benchmark was also a new track uh, that we did not see following. Forza 4. Top Gear, we've always had. The Scuba Circuit. Oh, man. Don't even start with that. One of my favorites. Both sections. We usually used to run the Short Circuit, which was a very nice tandem session there would run that for hours and hours twin ring motegi as well too is another track that did not come back but overall though i mean you can see the content in this game and that is why it was a big thing for me man it was a big thing for a lot of people now if we go into the buy cars we're going to get treated with a lot of damn vehicles man look at all the manufacturers in this it was just absolutely ridiculous we also had the addition of unicorn cars which included i believe 11 other vehicles um so you know a few cars that we just don't have anymore you know the top secret s15 stuff like that right so i mean a lot of vehicles um are amazing on this game and i mean oh my goodness man look at everything like absolutely ridiculous definitely goes down as probably my favorite motorsport game in the entire franchise to date uh i would love to know your thoughts in the comment section down below guys let me know your favorite to date as well too i'm just trying to pick right now a vehicle to do a drift build with to be completely honest with you um i have 10 million right now so i'm really thinking about this damn gt500 69 shelby live in here celine super cab oh man i missed that big girl oh my goodness the S5S Raptor. Oh, man. Pagani, what do we got here? Oh, man, we have quite a few of them. Um, Oldsmobile 442. Nissan. What do we have in the Nissan? Or Nissan, what, however the hell you want to pronounce it. The S14. Oh, my shit. We may be driving that for today. I really am feeling it. We also have the Skyline Coupe 350 GT. And this is identical to the g35 is just badged differently when it comes overseas man look at this g35 coupe and i actually did not even know that that damn skyline 350 was in the game i had no idea that it was in here which is actually pretty damn cool then to be honest with you but um damn man at least we have the right hand drive version though that's that's pretty damn sick 350 all the damn skylines look at them all man 370z r35 a lot of beautiful cars on this game and i'm telling you right now mercedes benz even had a boatload i'm gonna go through one more man let's choose one more to go through and then we're gonna build a car because i can't be doing this all day man there's too many cars hennessy honda uh let's go with i know man bmw i was reading your mind don't worry about it look at them all though man majority of them we still already have uh i don't think we had the 09 m5 coupe though i don't think that's in the game anymore um possibly though i could be wrong let me know in the comments please i know i said i was gonna do one more man i i, I was tempted with the chevy but where is my mustang man my three fit or where the hell is it why am i in chevy and looking for mustangs is the real question i don't i don't understand what the hell i was doing man i really don't i'm sorry uh so here we go where's my mustang at man where is it tell me it's here tell me i downloaded it please right here man the mustang boss 302 was my baby back in the day man like oh my god it's a nice car i gotta say i will be definitely building one of those very very damn soon but we're going back i think 
to one of my favorites, man. The 65 Pontiac GTO for today. Yes, I'd like to buy this damn thing. Appreciate it. Now, we're going to go with that kind of dark red purple. Whatever you want to call this thing. I don't know. But I used to get this car sideways quite a bit back in the day. We just got a damn thing called Goat Herder. Appreciate it. I don't know what the hell that was. But I... This is the main thing that I want to show you guys for today, man. Look at how fast these menus are, all right? So after I go through and decide what I'm doing, maybe we'll supercharge it. Sounds good. Um, but what do we have for motor swaps? G8. Nah. I'm all right with that. Appreciate it, though. Appreciate it. We're going to go with sport tires. And just, just clue in to see how fast this is actually taking real time. I mean, I'm going through and... You know, as long as I'm okay right here. But as soon as we get into, the, like, the actual drivetrain... Check this out. Watch this. Oh, shit. Oh, my God, man. I hit too many buttons too fast. I got cocky. I'm sorry. God damn it. All right. Let's try this again. <laughs> Wrecked, man. Wrecked on the fours of damn menus here. Okay, so. Driveline. Differential. Already did that. Brakes. Suspension. Sway bars. Full roll cage. Weight reduction, and then, I, I mean, it's just, it's so fast. And I really wish that they can go back to these faster menus. Because honestly, I don't even like building cars anymore. Because it takes so much time than what we're used to. You know what I'm saying? And I know that may sound lazy as hell. I'm sorry if it does, man. But that's just my honest opinion. Is that, you know, I feel like it just takes too long now to build up vehicles. It really does. And I mean, you gave us the best game possible for the four. And, you know, it's been very tough to top that. And until they top that, I don't think a lot of people are going to be satisfied. But we're going to go for a nice little test drive on... We, should we do Fujimi? Uh, debating about it. I'm also debating on good old damn Tuscuba right here. Yeah, we're doing it. Short circuit. Let's get our tuning on, man. 65 GTO. No rims necessary on this old girl. I love this thing, man. It's a boat. But she'll slide, man. I'm telling you, she will slide. And I'm even possibly thinking about softening up the suspension on this just for shits and gigs to see if maybe we can roll it, man. Listen to this idle, though. Holy. Oh, my God. My ears, bro. Oh, my goodness. That's a beast. That is a monster underneath the hood. Look at the backfire. Oh! Okay, okay, man. We, we don't want to break this damn thing right here. So, let's go ahead and get a quick tune on it. Just a bass tune, you know what I'm saying? Just start out nice and easy. Uh, I'm going to stretch out these gears just a slight bit. Uh, maybe go a negative one. Uh, yeah, that sounds good. That sounds good. Uh, just, just very quickly, you know, just a very quick bass tune on here. I don't want to, you know, mess with it too much. Like I said, we're going to maybe do one lap with it as an actual tune and then i'm thinking about potentially just throwing this on like a really damn soft suspension build and i forget what i called them back in the day man when i did these i ugh, it's boggling my damn mind right now what i called these suspension setups they're they weren't a jelly tune i'm pretty sure it was like uh i don't know man it doesn't matter let's get going here Oh, man, it's like I never left. I'm home, baby. I'm home. Oh, shit. Get off the damn rumbles, though. Here we go. Oh, she's getting some angle. Definitely need to be in this fourth gear, I think, for a little bit. I think Dom would be impressed right now, man. Why did I say Dom, man? Vin Diesel, Xander Cage is actually what I was meaning to say. I just came up with Dom right away. I let off on that damn corner. My mistake. Let's finish her strong here right now, though. Flipper. I tried, man. I tried to flip it. I didn't give enough gas, so to be honest with you. But... I mean, if this doesn't make you want to go back and play Forza 4, man, I don't know. 
because this game is just fantastic. I actually have this hooked right up to my Xbox One, so I can just kind of quickly transfer over. It's staying like this for a long damn time, and I'm telling you right now, we're going to get one last tune before we finish up this episode for today. Big thank you to everybody coming out for this special Forza 4 throwback, man. I, I've i missed this game, like I said, man. I've, I've said this probably so many times, but uh, this is really the reason why I was, you know, really kind of starting out my career with YouTube was this game, man. Forza 4, Forza 3, and this is kind of what, you know, made me keep going was this game. So, I mean, overall, it's sick to go back to it, man. It really is. Here we go. Look at this body roll. That's what I called it. Oh, yes. Look at that fourth gear. It needs a little bit more power, but it's alright though. Oh boy. Imagine seeing this thing coming at you. Oh my god. I definitely would need a little bit more power into this thing, but overall though, it's a very, very solid damn car. Ah, I thought I could make that. A little outside. A little bit of dirt never hurt, though, man. I'm telling you. Whip it. Oh, no, man. Come on. We can't finish like that. We got to get one more damn high speed on here. Ladies and gentlemen, don't forget to slap a like on this video if you did enjoy it. If you are brand new, don't forget to subscribe. Become a member of Team Slap today and start spinning some damn rubber with us. You guys can also follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, all of which are found in the description box down below. That was a shit damn entry though, man. Hold up. Hold up. We gotta get a better one, man. We gotta get a better one. This thing has so much weight to it. Well, not weight, but I feel like this game, the cars, they don't slide as much as Forza 5 and 6. You know, they're very planted to the ground, which is what I really liked about this game. But overall though, we're going outside. Ladies and gentlemen, Two more to slap train. I'm it. Grass life. Peace. Oh my god. What is going on, everybody? It's your boy to slap train. And welcome back, guys.